Oh, hey guys. I haven't seen you in a while. What's it been, a year? Oh, come on, come see my garden. Wait, wait, wait. So, uh, hi guys, I'm at home. This is Gigi. She's in heat right now, so she's a little stressed. Um, I'm sure some of you are wondering where I've been. So I thought I'd answer that real quick. If you're not interested, you can skip ahead a couple minutes and go to the garden video. It resumes probably just in like a minute or two. So I'm gonna try to do this as fast as possible. Last video, I was in Vietnam with Stacy. At around the same time that Stacy went home, I actually met uh, my now girlfriend on the streets of Hanoi, which is pretty interesting place to meet somebody. We traveled a little bit in Asia together, and then um, she had to go home to Germany. And I thought I wanted to be with her, spend more time with her. So um, I actually started traveling in Europe a little bit. I went to Bosnia, um, Greece, a lot of these Eastern European countries, and every once in a while flying to Germany and then back. So after a while doing this, uh, we decided to move in together, and she's studying in Germany still, so basically that meant I had to come to Germany. So right now I am living in Germany, and so just a little bit more about where we are right now. This is where I'm making leather at the current point in time. Um, it's important for later in the video, so keep this space in mind. And this is Gigi. She is our six month old bangle kitty. We got her about four months ago. And she'll also be joining us in the garden every once in a while. We took her for her first trip the other day and she didn't particularly like it, but hopefully that changes in the future as she adventures out on the leash a little more and out in the grass and in the garden so we'll see what happens okay back to the garden so we just got this garden for free one of the best things about germany is they have these like gardens all over the place and they're just i mean you can get them for practically free or free from the previous owner and all you have to do is pay the rent which for this one is 160 euros per year so they're super cheap, super awesome, and it's a little slice of nature when you live in the city. So we just got this garden like two weeks ago, but I just want to show you around the garden before and then show you hopefully in a little bit what we end up doing with it. So come on. So first I'm going to turn you around and show you where we just were. These are all grapes, all growing along this, grapes and roses. And here we have our first garden bed. These are four cherry trees. Yeah, they're sour cherries. I'm not sure how they're gonna be. Uh, go ahead and tell me if you've had them before. I've never actually had them, so I don't know if they're good to cook with or eat or what. Bushes, 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 bushes. Yeah, so right now we're growing carrots here, and um, we don't know what we're gonna grow over here yet, but I think probably potatoes. So we just built this guy right here and we don't know what we're gonna put in it, but we do know these are all raspberries and current currants. This right here is a plum tree. Carrots and lettuce, more carrots and lettuce. And here are some rhubarb plants that we didn't plant, but they're just doing fantastically. Um, we have some tomatoes in this little makeshift greenhouse. Is herbs. This is, I think, sage and rosemary, and this is also thyme and lavender. But we really rely on rainwater here to water the plants, so we're collecting at a couple different places. And this was all set up previously. It just wasn't. Uh, it was all falling apart. So we've we fixed it up a little bit. This is an apple tree that we just planted, and a blueberry bush that we also just planted. I have this beautiful willow tree that I'm also attempting to make a bonsai out of uh, the next, in the next uh, few weeks, so we'll see if that works. I'm gonna grow a bamboo wall just right here. This is our patio. This is a, one of the reasons that we picked this spot. It's got some privacy here, so I think this is gonna be really cool. We're obviously gonna get rid of like this trash. These white chairs are hideous. And now I take you inside the house, so come on. This is the house. Here it is. 
Um, this house is pretty small. I think it's like around 10 meters squared. I wanted a house that wasn't too much work, that I didn't have too much damage, and that I didn't have to spend two months building up. So in this room, this is the first room when you walk in, obviously. It's got windows all around, which are really beautiful. I already cut out this ivy here because it was overgrowing this whole side. So now we're getting nice light in this window. And we're basically just using this as a staging area, a planting area. This house does have electric, which is cool. And it also has water, but not the house. The, the pipe is outside. Um, and then this is the echoey second room. I've been getting into leather working a lot. Right now I'm just doing it on a table in our living room. I'm hoping, and I am going to, be moving all of my stuff into this room and turning this into like a small studio. And also, we have a little come down here to the cellar. A little murder cellar right here. Yeah. Um, this house is actually crazy old. It was built in the 1920s, so we actually we're not allowed to do a lot of things to the house, I believe, because it's historic. And I'm trying to think if there's anything else, and here's the back door to the patio, which you already saw, my backpack, little camera gear, and yeah, I think that's about it. So as you can see, the garden still needs a lot of work. Uh, in the next weeks, we're hoping to add a greenhouse and we're gonna build the house out to hopefully a really nice leather working studio, as well as doing all the farming, all the crop planting. And I think it's just gonna be like a really cool garden. So make sure to hit the subscribe button, hit the thumbs up button, it helps us out. Click the notification bell to be notified of the next video. And we will see you guys at the garden. Bye. Bye bye.